So here's what we need to make our Dijon vinegar oil dressing for our salad. It's really, really tasty. Um, you can use other oils, but you will get a different flavor. I have found the best flavor comes from canola oil, which is on the approved oil list for the first cycle of our menu plan. Um, I have this little nice handy dandy salad shaker which comes in really great, really useful for when I make large quantities of things. So the first thing we are going to do is make sure the camera is set up properly. There we go. I really do need a tripod, I think. So you open it up. It has this little thing in here. That's what shakes everything together. So it goes like that. There you go. So, um, the first thing we need is 12 tablespoons of oil. I know from experience with this salad shaker thing, that means I need to fill it to the 10, right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and just pour it to the 10, or you can actually use your measuring spoon for 12 tablespoons of oil. All right. Then we need to add our four tablespoons of white vinegar. So we will do that. One, two, three, four. And then we need to add our thyme and our tarragon, which I grabbed the wrong measuring spoon for those. So let me grab those real quick. So we're going to do the tarragon here. And I said in the recipe that it was quarter teaspoon. I'm using a half. And then I'm going to do about half of that for the time. Yeah, I know. This is what my dad always said, real cooks just wing it. So that's what I'm doing. So after that, we add our Dijon. Now I already know it's 12 little squirts. So it'd be like, well, first I gotta make sure it's ready. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I don't really measure this. I guesstimated. I could have been a, a little bit more, could have been a little bit less. You can always add more if you feel like it's lacking. So, um, and then we shake. Shake, 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 shake. And now it comes out and it looks very creamy. And I cannot wait to taste that on my salad later.